Oh no! Packy and Mylar, My Marlon, Mylar, Packy and Balloons, Packy and Marlon, two pachyderm pals with diabetes, are in heavy trouble. Summer camp has been raided by rats. These pesky critters have stolen food and critical diabetes supplies. Can Packy and Marlon find the food and supplies? To do it, they have to blast vicious varmints with peanuts and water. They have to remember to eat healthy stuff, check blood glucose levels, and take insulin. This is Packy and Marlon from Wave Quest and Raya Systems, released in 1995. And you thought Captain Novelin was the only diabetes-related game on the Super Nintendo, and you were wrong. Wallow in your shame. Uh, designed to improve self-care in children with diabetes type 1, or type 1 diabetes. Uh, had some success with treatment groups, part of an educational system from Rhea that included Captain Novelin, Rex Ronan, and Bronchi the Bronchiosaurus. I don't think we're looking at that one. Uh, but we did look at the other one, so you kind of know what you're getting into. Um, there's a legacy section for this. Uh, it's important in the history of therapeutic gaming concept that originated in the mid nineties with games such as the asthma focused bronchi, the bronchiosaurus because bronchial tubes, I guess a six month study in 97 on behalf of click health by researchers at Stanford on 59 diabetic children from eight to 16 found that after playing the game, children were four times less likely to require urgent care visits. A three month study found that for kids with diabetes, the game decreased their diabetes related emergency room and urgent care visits by 77%. It was also tested at Kaiser hospitals where it was shown to have given important information to diabetics while also encouraging the patients to offer support to each other. Wow. Uh, we don't have any reception data for it, but that's really cool. I, like, you know, guys like me and everybody else, we play these games and kind of make fun of them because they're not very good. You really don't know. It just feels like bullet points from a Wikipedia article just kind of sandwiched in between platforming sections that don't make a lot of sense. Which, gameplay-wise, it's exactly what it feels like to me, but I don't have any type of diabetes, one or two. Um... But you know what? It's that is really cool. No, I like that. Um, here's a quote from Deborah Lieberman, the designer of the game. Packy and Marlin was designed to help remove the stigma of being different. So young people with diabetes who played the game with their friends um, and saw that their friends did not consider diabetes to be a big issue would be more willing to do important self care throughout the day, even when their friends were around. And this is what actually happened. That is awesome. You guys did a great job. Then I was going to make fun of you. I apologize. So, no, um, I mean, it's still not a game that you just want to sit down and play. Let's not get rid of ourselves here. Uh, but if it's helping save lives or helped save lives and help reduce um, urgent care and emergency room visits by 77%, you know, that's, you guys did a great job.